Uh, good afternoon guys. We are here walking downtown Belize City from the Pongyard Bridge heading downtown towards the City Hall and Swing Bridge side showing you guys the town side of Belize City where a lot of um, vendors set up on the street side a majority of the big stores are out here this side so let's go Check it out, so this is uh, called Orange Street. It's a uh, continuation of Cemetery Road. And it's about three quarters of a mile long. The architecture here, the buildings, is old colonial. Some of these buildings are 100 plus years old. Here, uh, here. Uh, what you notice is uh, you go to a lot of food vendors, you go to a lot of little shops. Very unique, very different from what we used to in, uh, in other countries, but uh, pretty awesome place. So, we, uh, we just got to uh, come down, we're going to show you the shops on the side of the road, um, show you the people, the cultures, the architecture, uh, and yeah. So we're passing a couple of stores selling clothes, food. You know. So guys, downtown Belize City is where the locals come and get everything they need. I mean, house appliances, um, gadgets, clothes, everything they need is downtown Belize City. Right here, guys. Yo, bro. No change, bro. Pass a lot. Another clothing shop. There's normally a police checkpoint here. Uh, I'm not manning the checkpoint. Why are you turning it around? I just put it with your hand. Police checkpoint, this is our... This is our main checkpoint in the downtown area. Police is not out here, but it's not the main terminal. This is Magic Finger. This is a um, uh, gadget set. Fix different um, appliances and stuff going down. This is a primary school in the downtown area as well. A drugstore. This is just one drugstore that we're passing at the shop. This is a um, beer shop. Spa, hair and nails. In a grocery uh, store shop. I wish I am so glad to open. Military crews, but this is where uh, all the beauty of family studies. Everyone come up there on their free time. Come and hang and get some food. That's another salon. Uh, 
so the thing guys they have a list of me and they saw me at home Back in the baby store. Yep. Uniform store that I said. Pawn shop. Pawn shop. I mean we have more than one jewelry shop on this side, more than one pawn shop. Um, that's pawn store in front there. Okay. This is a sewage. This is what we call the East Palette Canal. It heads straight from one side of the north side to the south side of Billy City. All the way down. Blappy wireless. This is a gadget store. And we have a lot of clothes store. On this side, mostly males. Male stuff. In these ones. Over there, have a lot of female stuff. <laughs> I don't say I don't know. Yes, you know, this is what we call cosmetics. This is a female store here. Don't tell you. Know. I mean, there's a lot out here, but I stuff out here that Belize and comes to get. Mostly clothing and appliance store. Over here you have um, home appliance like TVs, blenders, microwave, of course. Home appliance stuff in this store here, guys. Um, they even sell clothing. Most of the stuff. We have a lot of TVs and blenders, microwaves. I can do four ninety five. Sure, sure. Thank you, sir. Smart, smart. Fire built in, yeah. Fire edition. Alright, so guys. A lot of nice brands are in here, guys. I always, I always make the mistake because the trans, the translation between U.S. and Belize dialect. It's about four, four ninety-five. Four ninety-five Belize. That's approximately two fifty US. Uh, pretty good price for uh, Zinga. Um So I'm, I'm definitely coming back because I need it for work for photography and stuff. So. You know this. We have Insignia. Do you want to say anything about your shop? Ninja. Sorry. Do you want to talk about your store? Uh, I'm a bit shy for it. Okay, okay. Bit shy. We're okay. still promoting your shop. Yeah, yeah. Your store. Yes, yes sir. In here you get to see a lot of TV also and speakers, washing machines. I mean every single thing down to mattresses. Whoa, careful the careful more. the ground. <laughs> yeah. show, show the ground. I almost fell in. You gotta be careful of the holes over there. This shop over here, hats, belts, mirrors, cases for electronics. Yep, belts and wallets, um, different kitchen appliances, knives, dish, fork, cups. How many days do you have here? Plan up here? What days do you come out? Yeah. You're here every day? Uh huh. Every day. Every day. Except Sundays. Except Look. Sundays. Okay, every day but Sundays. 
that's Cosmo, that's another um, cosmetology store. We have Patsy, Patsy is very famous downtown Belize City for um, their bikes. Everyone wants a new bike, they come to Hot Sing. Yeah, this is like the only brand of bikes, right? Yeah. Uh, Even if you want to fix your bike, you can bring it at Hot Sing and they bring it back brand new for you. A variety of different bikes here at Hot Sing Store. For the same one. There are two different bikes, guys. Up and on now. As you can see. And they even fix your stuff for you. Why are you getting this course up? Come on. Oh, for YouTube? For YouTube, for YouTube vlog page, man. Yeah. You, is it okay? It's from what we'll, we'll, we'll cut it out then. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll take this out. Okay, then. we'll take it out of the audience. We, my, my audience in the US, they do this, they travel and they show them how to do okay. it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Where to find different stuff in the East. But if you don't want it, we'll take it out. Yeah, we'll, out. we'll take it out. Sorry, man. So this is Hot Sing guys. Hey. Another tourist spot, the famous Medina House of Glory. Yes, I got my wedding bag from here. Yep. But if we cross the swing bridge, come back in the middle of the Yeah. So usually during the day we're bustling, uh, or in the afternoon it's no bustling because during the day everybody's at work or at school, so it's a really nice to have today. But we're going to uh, we're gonna have some of it here. Uh, this is a client store. Client store. Five in Boston. Afternoon. Ah, the famous season. Belize City Hall. This is where the mayor of Belize operates and his pensioners. Another Jewish store here, guys. Another so you are, if you're getting off the cruise ship and you're very new to Belize, a lot of Belizeans they wear these little bangles. Yes. Uh, they come in sets of two. I uh, I see a lot of them. My wife has them. They also have bingo uh, rings. I don't see them here, but they also have bingo rings to match. Oh, see them here. Oh yeah, right here. So yeah, if you uh, if you look for a, a truly unique, easy and gift for your significant other, the lady of your life, definitely go with uh, the bangles. I would. Uh, they're they're definitely a Belizean single. They come in pairs, they buy them in Good luck, flat, you know, This is the uh, famous Marani store. This is a Marani female store. Uh, they have female things. They have good deals for the Valentine. I forget, but I, I never tell you I don't have my time. Another variety of jewelry here. Different chains, rings, yeah, earrings. Um, this this drug store is very famous. This is one of the first drug store in Belize. It is called the Central Drug Store, downtown Belize City. Um, this is very famous. We're coming up on the street. So we're definitely on the middle of Belize City. This swing bridge is exactly the middle of Belize City, guys.
Swing bridge here. This used to swing, and it's the oldest swing bridge. Uh, and I am familiar with it. Where where got it? The right behind me here is the fishers. Uh, they they set sail from this little shop here. And they go out and they dive, they fish, and they bring back the fresh cash from the market that you saw the other day. Um, and then uh, yes, with this uh, this bridge right here, very very old. It yeah. swings guys when 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 um you got hurricanes and um different weather coming the boats on the other side need to pass and go more inland so they might want to turn the bridge so that the boat can pass swing bridge very rare of its kind See another pink boutique here down town Belize City. Charles, I was actually Jails. looking for that. Um, they they had moved. They are on um, over on Douglas Road Street. Oh, okay, okay. Because I was like, I was looking for them the other day and I couldn't find them on this puzzle. We're going to come up here uh, to the police station and check them out. I'm going to show you guys the uh, Albert Street. But uh, this is a continuing. Uh, what street is this one? This is Queen Street. Queen Street, yes. yeah. Yeah. Um, after the swing bridge, you head on down to Queen Street where the continuation of the. We're still downtown Belize today. We can find a variety of stuff also. Um, we had just passed the famous castle building that had burned down. That had burned down, I mean, um, so many years ago and it had just built back in 2019. Okay. Why is from the pool? <laughs> Careful not to trip up on the electrical boards. Wow. These ones are so low, you can touch them. So low you can touch them. Uh, no passing independence hall, guys. This is um, the POP government that are in government right now. This is their headquarters, named Independence Hall. Alright guys, if you are if you're following uh, Saturday, make sure that you like, share, subscribe to the channel because on Saturday we're going live from this show, center stage, front stage, right in front of the stage, on stage. We're gonna have some fun. This is Shut Down Belize 2023 and it's uh, exclusively live uh, with uh, Jason's World. So check it out, subscribe so you can get the notification that we're going live. Featuring a variety of artists hailing all the way from Jamaica, um, some of the least local artists as well. Uh, good afternoon. Afternoon. Um, this store here is one of the least very biggest um, school appliance store. That's in. Statistics is coming up, but they're not even open. What are they? No, they're closed. They're not closed? Yeah, they're not closed. Um, I guess this is Billy's biggest um, police station in the city. Queen Street Police Station. This is Queen Street Street. Here, downtown Billy's yeah, city. What's up, guys? Right, this yeah. right here is my big cousin. He partly Respect. raised me as well. Respect. You know, he's a security at one of the famous stores in Billy's Diamond Point. So here is Simon Kwan guys, one of the famous stories you can get a lot of things down here. Pass the back from. So just imagine guys, this is the biggest station here in the city. And it's still pretty much little. So just imagine the other one. Oh. 
Should we go back? Yeah, go back. Oh, you ready to go back? Or not? Also, we'll go back and uh, over this ridge. Okay. Okay. Let's go. 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 let us you know what we call these here, bro? Yeah. We call them poxies. Poxies? Yes, poxies. Can I get one? That's gonna be hard. Yeah. Trust no, me, I wanna it's get gonna one. be very hard. I wanna get one. Oh, it's geez. gonna be hard. You know how you get them, them to, ah. you get those to come at you? Huh. If you had a cut on your feet, oh. and you put your feet in there. Oh, do you, they like little They will come and pick it. And you know that actually makes your room get better. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. That's a Belize and norm. I'm going to have to try that. A cut, a sore, anything. You put your feet in there, they're yeah. actually going to pick it. Okay, guys, where are you walking in? Look over the street. <laughs> uh, because there's really no sidewalk on, on the other side. Um, so we're we coming we're back down to the street. In our know. fashion store. Afternoon, mom. So again, prices are in Belize dollars. So uh, this is 10 Belize dollars, which is 5 US. 12 Belize dollars, uh, 6 US. 25 US, uh, Belize dollars, 12 dollars, 50 cents US. Pretty simple, pretty quick mathematics. Yeah. Um, just 50%. Two for one on the dollar. Um, this man here, he's very famous for his herbs. He's a natural herb tech. Um, he sells different medicines and different herbs for you guys to actually come. He's very famous for his herbs here. Keep party. People's United Party headquarters. Belize Band first. This is the PUP government that is actually in government right now. This is their headquarters, downtown Belize City. It's also named Independence Hall. Check it out guys. We're out of the surface. That's easy you can come in scary step. And it's not only there. This takes a long way up to the way around the block. Security actually took it in somewhere right now. Those are more, more uh, post office boxes over there. Walking right past the famous Pasla building. Afternoon, you're good? Yeah, we're right there. Uh, are the Pasla back right now? I don't even have a post office box, so let's go uh, show you guys what it's like to open the box. It's a little old skeleton key. Um, per year it's 60 Belize, so $30 US. If you're not a Belizean, uh, you have to show proof of residence or proof of uh, address. So you have to have an address in Belize, a lease, a car, some kind of bill payment or something. Uh, once you have that, you can get a, a PO box. It takes about three weeks to a couple of months for mail to get here from the U.S. So if you're looking for something quick and expedient, it's lack of, uh, you know, single day services, but for regular postal mail, this is uh, pretty simple. Uh, just if you don't mind reading. I probably don't have anything, but let's give it a check. All the way down here. This is 
Yeah. And I got no. Um, Let's check it out, guys. Can I try to come and store this stuff? So, Bill, uh, we shipped here from the U.S. It's, uh, the address is kind of difficult. Uh, it's the postal address. There's no zip codes here. So, um, what I'll do is in the comments and uh, description of the video, I'll kind of show how to send mail. In fact, I'll leave my mailbox number if y'all want to send something to Chase's World. Um, you can send it through my box. Um, this library here is very famous too as well. Oh yeah, it's let's been take a look at the library. For a while. This is a Turkin library. I mean, they always do operative stuff for the youth. used to use way back in the day Luther Washta they used to scrub on scrubbing board we call them the scrubbing board um, that's the wash bucket we have a kettle different believe artifacts not for the reasons we used to use back in the day. That's a grater. We call that the grater. That is made by hand. And people used to cook food with those. The spoon and the bowl. That's an iron. 
this one just to put it on what we call the fire hot let it get hot over fire and then you use the press with it this one is what we use to put gas in in the back and lead it up it gets hot and they press away this one is a stove top one as well we call it a stove top we place upon the fire to get hot and it lit up we have different lamps as well pretty much cool guys yeah no artifact Pretty much cool, and that's pretty much the one we do on the way. Billies and eagles, guys. People that actually stand up and fight for something worthy of Billies and here in the country. Two Belizean dollars for a 20 ounce coke. They want me to be in the video. Belizean Chinese food. Definitely good. Definitely different than normal Chinese food that we're used to in like the US and other places. Sort of thing, and school is getting out, so we're gonna start seeing more and more of the uh, culture, the schooling, that sort of thing. Um, so, so we're officially at what we call the tourist village here in the city, guys. Every time I walk through here, I get confused for a local, I mean, a tourist. I guess I look like a tourist. It's kind, of, it's kind of hilarious to say that, but uh, I, I'm a local. I'm a local. He's a local, guys. He resides here. Good evening, Mom. Hello, guys. So Hello. Can, have dollars, sir? can you have a dollar? Can you have a dollar? I don't have any dollars. Right here, sir. Please. How much are you? No shame, bro. I'm a person walker. Sir, it's not bad. That's the unfortunate thing about this uh, the country here is uh, there is a uh, aspect of poverty here that is pretty extreme. Um, the yes, necessity of uh, four dollars, sir. Which is I'm sorry. Sir, I can go back. Four dollars, sir. Right? Sir. So that is the unfortunate part of uh, of this area. A lot of the youths, man. It's just so. Uh, like I was saying, we met Kim Barrow, the former first lady okay, of Belize, in a previous video called right. Buttonwood Bay. Check it out, you guys, uh, when you finish with this one. Um, about halfway through that video, 
we were sitting down eating and we ended up meeting uh, Kim Burrow and that was pretty cool. She, former, former first lady just walking about uh, with one assistant and uh, no problems. That's the beauty of this country is... Did somebody call me? No, that's way over there at that, oh. at that primary school. I was like, wait, did somebody say my name? <laughs> Right? Yes, this is ACC, this is the Anglican Cathedral College. Um, same way we have Wesley College and you guys saw Wesley Church. This is the Anglican Cathedral College and we're going to see the Anglican Church. There it is. That goes right. So that's ACC, the Anglican Cathedral College. Um, right across from it is that is where we can find the Anglican Cathedral Church. Now this church has been around, this is the longest standing church here in Belize. One of the first to build. And actually it's been around about 210 years. Yeah. You know, in Belize, everybody is into some kind of religion, and I actually went to an Anglican school, and I am actually baptized as an Anglican. This right here is my church. So, as you can see, let's go way up. So the high school is right across from their church. Not like what's the college which is where around the lane from its church. Good afternoon. I was giving him history about my church. This is my church. Good evening, okay. ma'am. Good evening, dear. You can take pictures if you like. If you want to light a candle, you can do that over there. They just have to give a donation towards the restoration of the church, right? Um, if you like, I can give you a little explanation or if you just want to take pictures. Uh, we just want to take a couple pictures. I'm from here. Uh, we're doing a bl uh, Belize blog. Oh, nice. And, uh, nice. So let it do it know. All right. Yes, ma'am. Okay, well, thanks for stopping by. You're welcome, ma'am. You can see the altar. Guys, I used to serve as an acolyte in this church, man. It's been so many years. Whew. This is a historical site in Belize, guys. This said church right here. Oh, sorry, mom. Sorry, mom. You're welcome. Yeah, 
Younger, the kids used to come in this side here. It's another sacred place. It has its own altar and everything. Man, this place brings back so many memories, man. We actually used to get dressed behind here to go and actually serve the Lord. Joey behind the altar, getting up close and personal. But, yeah, St. John's Church, man. St. John's Cathedral. Actually has a name. From the Bible, St. John's. This church is a historical site. That's why you can actually come in and take pictures. This is the longest living church here in Belize City. This is a small replica of the whole entire building. Just feel good to actually come back in this place, man. See? From... I don't know if you can see good. You want to get a picture of this? From 1812 to 2012 was 200 years. So from 2012 to 2023, that's 9 years now. So it's 209 years old. That's how long this church has been here. I really love this place, man. This used to be another home for me when I was little. The we actually came down Belize City. I mean downtown. I'm showing the tourists downtown Belize City, but I told him to let go at the church. To get a blog about the church, so we do the market, we do the old day. Instead of like going to do like uh, five days of all of the leaves, mm -hmm. you want to do like one day of one day of that's half. Okay. And that time we can see. Okay. And uh, we're also going to be going out to other countries or to America, Guatemala, check them all. Okay. We're going out to all of the I see they, um, they have an earthquake in Honduras. Yes, now I'm 6.4 magnitude. Yeah. I actually was laying down and I felt it I jumped up. But mom, can I ask you to please remember my name and pray that I come back. And yeah. I really have been longing to come at this place. <laughs> it's been a while. So you go, man. Well, it's not the building that will save you, you know. It's you have to save yourself. So. And you can always pray to God. Whether you're here or whether you're at home, I try to pray walking. every night and morning. You know, so 
But it's good to drop in now and again. No, like, and later. Yes, my mom used to be a regular yeah. here and everything changes. That's okay, that's how you go and start again. Yes, mom, you take right, care. Enjoy the rest of your walk. Same to you, mom. Huh? Desmond Smith was a Society of St. Francis, born 10th of March 1937, brother deacon priest, bishop of the East. Quintus in, in peace. peace. Oh, rest in peace is the uh, translation. 19th of August, These are most people that serve as a priest here at the church. Um, I this that, that's a bishop, and this here, these two is husband and wife. Mr. and Mrs. Sylvester. So yeah, St. John's Cathedral. The sun is a little clear. A lot has changed here in this place. We've got so many memories. Guys, if you get to Belize and you're, uh, you believe in God, if you have some religious aspect of your life that you need to work through while you're here, beautiful church. Uh, check out uh, Jaisha's blogging. Jaisha's blogging. Uh, check out Jaisha's blogging at jaisha'sworld.com. And uh, I'll have all of the pictures uh, available there. You can check it out. I definitely would say come back. And, and get a uh, picture of the sign. Yeah, definitely come back and uh, take a look at this place. It's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. So this is this church is located downtown Belize City at the end of Albert Street. <laughs> this house has been here. Um, I think it's over a hundred years as well. They just tried to rebuild and rebuild and rebuild. And this is a part of the Alican Cathedral Church. This is the urban garden. They try to support homeless and different people. With they, this is their soup kitchen. They actually grow their own um, veggies and fruits to actually serve homeless and you know people in need with soup and different food every Tuesday. Every Tuesday. So heading back uptown through the town. Well, you know, man, vlog. Y'all want to come, you know, man, vlog, I'm going to say, you know. Huh? Vlog for what? 
Just make sure the tourists there, oh Belize. I know I catch a lot of them right down the Yeah, I don't got a lot of it for you too. Go go check out J Shan's world. Right then. Shop has closed. <laughs> yo, I tell yo, like yo. I think they waited for the school kids to pass by, and it's already after four. Uh, yeah, no, three forty. Three forty. I don't know how they shut so quick. They said, okay, no more school kids. <laughs> Maybe it's that, indeed. Battlefield Park, Swing Beach. Why do you need that sign for this thing? That's the lower school. Yeah, you see how you have Wesley College? Yeah. You have Wesley Lower. This is where um, kids between third grade and third grade to third grade to sixth grade go here. Okay. Yeah, and then you have Wesley Upper because this is the lower. You have Wesley Upper where you have kids from um, between six, seven, and eight, seventh and eighth grade <laughs> over on um, Dolphin Street. And then you have Wesley College that's where you go from ninth grade to twelfth grade and you graduated. But we have it as Infant one to standard two, from standard three to standard six, and from first form to fourth form. So Wesley have from second grade up until twelfth grade. American clothing only. Guys, what you notice here is a lot of color. This is beautiful color. The, the scenery is just vibrant. Markets. Got a shop. So fast food. Closer to the tourist section, uh, individuals uh, find this area a decent area to make a little money. Um, I'm not going to begrudge them for whatever household or whatever need that they need to do. So it's just unfortunate part of life. Here is the Belize Marine bus terminal. So if you want, you can walk down and then walk through the terminal and then out and then. For those that are at home, Belize City is very safe. It's, uh, I don't believe the hype when I first came here. I read everything on the State Department website. I read everything online. You know what? Uh, oh, you know, there's uh, bad stuff, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Screw that. It's, uh, it's a very safe place. I walk around here regularly. Um, at night, I have uh, very expensive equipment, uh, stuff like that. I don't fear. I take the normal amount of precautions that I would 
uh, in less precautions than I would if I were in Chicago or something, which is much more dangerous than the big city um, and a much higher population density. So I absolutely would say uh, friendly people, safe environment, um, take the normal precautions that you would normally take if you're going somewhere you don't know. But besides that, uh, I don't believe the hype online. That's why we're making Jason's World. That's why we're doing the channels. Uh, that's why we're trying to pump out positive stuff because this is a beautiful country, beautiful people, beautiful culture, beautiful scenery, geography, and it's got a bad reputation. We're gonna try to change that. You wanna uh, flip around and? Yeah, so this is pretty much the end. Uh, so what we have here is a call center. One of the biggest employers is uh, the call centers and that's because you know, uh, yeah, uh, the call centers can take U.S. clients and because the Belizeans are English speaking they're able to uh, handle the call center traffic. The opposite of that is the pay is garbage and that's why they bring the call centers here. Unlike in the U.S. where it's around 15 U.S. per hour, the minimum wage here is five dollars Belize, which is two dollars and fifty cents U.S. per hour. And typically, it's a six-day, eight-hour day work week. Uh, and if somebody doesn't want to make five dollars an hour and they don't want to work six days a week, that's too bad. Somebody else will. And so they're kind of forced into this uh, cycle, which is pretty extreme. These U.S. companies, the uh, the brain. Uh, the call center and other jobs down here because of the uh, incredible uh, low cost of labor which is from an economic standpoint it's understandable from a human standpoint it's completely bullshit that's a inside here is that part of the village? can you guys get my ship? no, I live here Two of you live here? Yeah, yeah I live in Italy. Yeah. <laughs> yes, man. Yes, sir. Yes, all right? Hey, man. I just want a picture of you. This is my big sister too, as well. <laughs> you I know. Take care. Yeah, Jess, you too. I thought he was going to trip that we can't fit you. So, uh, See, little merchant stand here. Uh, my electricals. Beautiful. Beautiful craftsmanship. These are handmade. Uh, I like these. I actually have several of these in my apartment right now. You didn't go. Yeah. Check these out, guys. So if you're coming up the ship, definitely check out the merchants. These guys put their heart, their labor into this. Yep. Um, you know, it may it may seem like it's uh, just a little trinkets and stuff like that, but it's really not. This is uh, amazing craftsmanship. Yeah, the, you know about the um, the the. Uh, they, they sit out here, they sell one or two items a day, uh, and they, they just put in all of their love and effort. So definitely give them some business, give them some love. Um, they're working for very little, and uh, they put their passion into it. So we're going into uh, the terminal here. This the Marine area. Terminal. Uh, you would catch uh, the water taxi to the islands, Key Cocker and Burgess Key, uh, which is San Pedro town. Also in here you have the typical tourist shops uh, with you know the, the typical tourist stuff. Um, I would recommend leaving this area if you come in from a cruise ship and uh, going to the local vendors, the local town. Go into town. Go to the locals where we were just at on Orange Street. Go to that area. Purchase your stuff from there. Give, the, give uh, your business to these. Uh, locals who will benefit uh, and benefit the economy as opposed to these areas which are more commercialized more uh, standardized I guess and uh, touristy traps you know so I would definitely say take the extra minute to walk right across the water the swing bridge where we were get whatever you need over there and support the local tra uh, Belizean shops as opposed to around here but everybody in line here looks like they're going back to the cruise ships or yep. they're getting on a water taxi. The line is very much long. Yep.
So the line of people getting ready to get on the boat. So we got a little uh, plaza over here where uh, the cruise ships will come in on the boat and you can kind of shop and do that kind of thing. This is the tourist area. Like I said just now, skip this area, just go right across the bridge, right there. And you will be able to get the local shops, the local economy will be supportive from what you do. Yeah, these tourist trap areas, they're fine for entertainment and stuff like that, but I personally want to give my business to the locals. And you're going to get better deals, you're going to get better food and better product if you just take an extra couple of minutes to go over there and avoid the tourist trap. This is the honorary Honorary Consulate for Austria in Belize. Is it Austria? Yeah. Austria. We have here you have the like law offices, businesses, or uh, little uh, administrative shops and stuff like that. So in other words, uh, the tourist areas here are extremely safe. There's a lot of tourists in the east. Uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, individuals here who will answer your questions. They will talk to you. Don't be tricked by the taxis. Uh, the, the, the taxi rates are around ten dollars anywhere in Belize City. So um, you, when you talk to the taxi before you get in, just be like, you know, how much would it yeah, take? Yeah, be. Make sure you just negotiate the proper price because it's usually ten dollars anywhere within one stop of Belize, but it is a shared taxi. So don't be surprised if. You stop and pick somebody else up and take it. <laughs> uh, shot. Another interesting thing is, uh, when you use the public restrooms, there is a there is a charge for it. A dollar Belize is 50 cents, so that uh, the maintenance, the water, the uh, the cost of cleaning, that sort of thing can be covered. Um, that's a unique to uh, Belize in general. Most of the public restroom does charge. Uh, more tourist areas, more um, like this. That's about it. Dude. I love going up the side. Dude. Uh, the city council or city? This is a department of the city council here. Okay. Um, I think this is tra yes, this is traffic department. Okay. Mm -hmm. the municipal court. Yeah. Local traffic officer here in the city. Okay, you no know, water on the side of the street. Definitely get some if you're here. Uh, very good yeah. for you, Rafi. I'm going to send you a glass Still not getting no change, bro. Still not getting no change, bro. No change. I'm going to walk out the guys so then. No, I said we don't get no change, then. So uh, a lot of these windows are broken because of Philippine Lisa. 
direct hit right here to Belize City. Um, awesome trinkets here, beautiful, beautiful. I've got a couple of items from these shops. Girl from the drums. I mean, I know a lot about Belize now. <laughs> <laughs> Being here for as long as I have, it's, uh, check it out. I love it. Um, so, this area, we're leaving again, uh, headed back to the swing bridge. Um, typically, uh, I, I, I typically avoid this area unless I want to be mistaken for a tourist. <laughs> um, I, I like to give my business and my uh, uh, support to the, 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 the local economy, the local businesses. That area over on Orange Street where we're gonna go head back over to uh, right now. I also find myself speaking for you all a little bit. So uh, by the next, uh, in a year, when you see me on the video, I'll be speaking full-fledged Creole, and Warren will have to translate for me. <laughs> um, there's another water taxi. Uh, this water taxi has regular stops at uh, three different keys. Um, it'll be hours. This is the one I typically take, uh, the Caribbean Sprinter is the one I typically take, but I think most of them all have a generally the same time. Uh, they don't fluctuate too much. The price depends on if you're a local or if you're a tourist. Um, you, uh, the, 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 once you buy the ticket, it's kind of a placeholder. It's not actually a set date. So you can purchase the ticket and it's good for 30 days. Uh, I recommend buying the round trip at once because it's a little cheaper and uh, having it uh, once you're out on the island you can return any day in the next 30 days yep. you have the return trip. Uh, what you notice out here a lot of these boats these are fishing boats over here on the right and then out in the distance you see the cruise ship uh, the cruise ships come in regularly it's a big portion of the economy here 40 percent of the gross deficit product here in belize is based on tourism so these cruise ships are vitally important for the belize economy uh, oh. dory dory yes dory that's a dory Okay. Yeah. What? <laughs> Call the doctor and be like, yo, we need to do this again. Not they're gonna be like, man, every week. <laughs> Keep me in business. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna walk down to uh, Albert's seat here. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Another interesting thing here is you just cross. Uh, if you're in uh uh, the crosswalks are in the middle of the street and not at the corners. And uh, you just kind of just walk out in front of traffic and they stop for you. I mean, they have to stop or else they're going to get a charge for right. not so, stopping at the pedestrian. Right, and so it's a very interesting... Uh, me, I, I get fearful because I'm not crossing at the corner usually. I'm crossing in the middle of the street. This is Albert Street. Uh, another section. Uh, another section of uh, downtown. Common, yeah, downtown Belize and Commerce. Uh, you'll see some bigger shops here. Uh, this is uh, Ace of Belize. Hardware. You see the school children in their uniform. Every student here has a specific uniform that matches their school. Um, so all of these students are all all white. Um, yeah, so that's Wesley College. Wesley College. Oh, 
So the plaza actually start from the beginning to the end. Hey guys, you guys, this is a 7-Eleven shop. Publix. This is where I get my uh, Mountain Dew. Points two for five, two dollars for uh, these, one dollar for these products. This is.
Not a local shop. That's actually owned by a um, Hindu guy. A lot of the stores out here in the downtown area are actually owned by Hindus. And uh, we have local Belizeans as well. Even and even. Yes, that's the romantic Is that like a woman's shelter? Huh? Is that like a woman's shelter? No. <laughs> uh, she's <laughs> yeah, Hopi. Hopi. Now I'm ready here, though. Yes, man. This is the 
Demos Wesley Church, guys. Wesley College? Yes. Um, that's their school church. That's Wesley College School Church. That's the Methodist Church here in Belize City. They know in religion, they have the same religion. Afghan? Yes, man. <laughs> and we're actually at the end of what we call downtown. It's pretty much the end. Um, um, if you notice, this guy's in brown pants and white top. That's ACC as well. Two high schools. Less than a mile away from each other. Right downtown Belize. Oh, we fought the Lego at Sinjai Cathedral. That's the most famous church in Belize. Um, that's been around 200 and around years. The longest standing church. Want to grab a bite? Huh? Want to grab a bite? I don't mind. Just when we come back? Come back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we see you alright? Well, we used to do a vlog of the whole out of town, city part of town. Here is um, the former Prime Minister, Dean Barrow. This is his equity house. Barrow and Williams Limited. Alpha Service Limited. For those of you who don't know, I met uh, Kim Barrow the other day. Uh, just walking around, former First Lady, uh, and Dean Barrow's his wife. And we were. So she had this way, so you probably catch her on the Charisha, where are you going for me? I had to tell you that. Where are you going, man? You alright? It's been a long time, guys. How are you, Mother? Good. Tell her to say hi, right? Yeah. So guys, what are you doing, right? In Belize, I work taxi cab license in Florida and Blue. And um, if you see a uh, van with the green um, license plate, that's what we call Balavan here in Belize City. They only traverse one certain area and they charge, used to charge dollar for a drop. Anywhere in the area that you want to go that they travel, 
but now it's two dollars but you know Belizean still call them dollar van so <laughs> here is the famous Jaysha coming heading down the, our way the famous Jaysha because we love her <laughs> guys you gotta keep up with Jaysha's world and Jaysha's vlog hey <laughs> so Jaysha the famous Jaysha So where we're heading, Geisha? Geisha. 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 Mm -hmm. So now go look for it. Who are you gonna take that market set? Uh, I just need to think about that. I know if I'm the third set market that they are guys. Yeah. Famous Jesha guys, checking out shoes. Alright, you guys, we should take a, uh, a poll to see which shoes Jesha should get. Actually, these are nice. Oh. I like these actually. These are nice guys, but looks like Jisha is more looking for the comfort. Your boy know women's shoes. <laughs> How much? Thirty.
Well, guys, you know it's around Valentine's. Jaisha has been looking for Valentine's outfit. So, you know how the girls do. So this store is downtown Orange Street guys. Um, it has a variety of female stuff, down to shoes, pants, clothes, bra, you name it for females, it's in here. Huh? Everything women. Belt. Um, you name it, it's in here guys. Um, and it goes from different children. Start from kids to women. Don't fall on the sidebar. Did it clear? Thank God. Because, yo, when I used to forget my shares, uh, people like, don't want to do it. I don't want to give it from the show. So the guys, this is like a, the equivalent of Subway in the US, but different. Uh, you generally get all of the sub variety, so it's not too bad. Two meter, okay? Yes. The small ham. Let's give it to what? To what is small ham Yeah, it's 
the, the, the most famous Jaisha in all of the Indies. Joey and Jaisha guys. And let's not forget our friend. Of course. Warren. Amazing oh, guy here. <laughs> So that's how they actually prepare the stub here at Belize. Instagram, where the tourists can find you on Instagram? Uh, sorry? Where, what, and under what name can they find you on Instagram? It's by the name Subs Express. Subs Express, guys. Yeah. Here it is. Subs Express. Subs Express. Subs Express. Very legitimate business, guys. Yeah. I'm going to pull it up so I can show you guys. Check out the sub whopper. Oh, okay. Sub rock. Alright, you guys. Here's their Instagram. Oh, yeah. Subs Express. The subsexpress.com. Let's see what that looks like. Maybe. Looks like a dead. But, uh, yeah, Subs Express. And uh, it's got some good pictures here. Stuffed pepper is my favorite. Mm -hmm. Check it out and get our next content there. So Jewish, Jewish is the well guys, they actually have a priority of stuff. Yeah, the website is part of it. I have a social media in the US for some You should check it out, so um, that's first. So, but I moved here, actually, that's all right. Um, Oh, wow. So check it out guys, Subs Express. 
on downtown Belize City and they have had a branch at Freetown Road. This is gonna try the food and tell you guys how good is it. Yeah, Johnny got it. Yo, um, what's up? What? Yeah. See, a lot of people are still there. Subs Express is located on Orange Street, corner of Orange Street, and the, this is the East Collet Canal here downtown Belize City. <laughs> this is the East Collet Canal. It, 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 it is from one point of Belize, that is the north side, to Way down on the other end to the south side of the city. Cool to come. What's up, Paul? Back up on the camera. Up on the camera. You know what I show the people there some of the Belizean product? You know what I show the people there some of the Belizean product? Oh, I flash it to you. Yeah. yeah. We uh, have donuts, guys. That's a Corona Tad Jumbo. Right here. Yeah, what's up? Oh, for what's up? Talk to me. That's a Corona Tad Jumbo, like donuts right here. This man is very famous yeah. for what he do, guys. Yeah. Which one you want? Right. Yes. Huh? Okay. Okay. Hi, Mom. Good evening. I just wanted to show them that. I just wanted to show them. I'm not buying. Oh, you ain't buying. You're going to make up for a silly man. Make up for one dollar. One dollar. Okay, then. One dollar. Okay, one, 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 four, four. One, one. Full basket. I like, right, your, I like, one, I like one. your drive. I like your drive. Thanks. What's your name? Mad. Can I take your picture? Sure. You'll see him sure. in anywhere downtown Belize City. Go with it. 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 Go if you disobey the Lord, your God, your God and I am faithful to all his laws. I'm coming and I'm giving you today. All this evil thing come upon you. you. Read it, you got it? You got it. You got it. Good. 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 Go with it. 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 Bless it. Belizean bar attack guys, downtown Belize City. Yeah, the whole team. Oh, Anybody on the camera? It's so hard not to fall in the holes. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm gonna, like, even though... Me and Joey look for drop boat. It's so much time. <laughs> Uniform shop for the... Cool I tried, but I'm hoping he get the best answer for the purple water. Yeah. Yeah, but the problem with that is, well, instead of how you respond to it tomorrow. You know, who are last year, I'm mad. Every concert, all my artists in the corner, I say, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm not reaching none. I said, who could tell exactly? I said, who could tell 
that I, Mo and Miss 450, and CJ, and um, Jashi, because I love their ballet. I don't like, yo. This is a really good And they actually do passport size picture here located downtown Belize City guys on Orange Street. Place. Oh yeah. Let's go! Well, I know what channel is that, channel 7, now they let it run through. 
and somebody else where I like somebody like uh, like what's happening in the news the border so so I am done to enjoy about there already that the promote actually the PNF record get content of the show when you say he's speaking to me but you still have like, the tree of me but then you know like no change Jesus Royal merch, some Jesus Royal hats, and handbags. Yeah. 
No change. Pretty cool. <laughs> it came out really good. Mm -hmm. Perfect sense. For this weekend, we'll hand these out to anybody who takes a picture of them. Um, we'll ask anybody who we'll asks. That's the name of the character. That's the one that's <clears throat> We're about to end because the battery is about to die. And it's our last battery. So, any last words? Bye, guys.